Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to iOS Pro Hacker. This is when you enter the iPhone passcode incorrectly more than six times. It started showing iPhone is disabled, but if you enter the wrong passcodes too many times, you will end up with a locked iPhone for 5, 15 or 60 minutes. In case, if you have forgot your iPhone passcode and entered incorrect passcodes 10 times, so your iPhone may stuck on the disabled screen permanently. You will see this type of screen, iPhone is disabled, connect to iTunes. In this case, the iPhone won't allow you to unlock the iPhone using the passcode. So here is the tutorial for you to fix iPhone is disabled or how to unlock forgotten passcode iPhone, iPad or iPod. So let's get started. Guys, you cannot fix your iOS device without having a computer. You must have a Windows PC or Mac to unlock your iPhone, iPad, iPod. So, it is a very easy method to fix your iPhone, iPad or iPod using the iTunes. I have already uploaded the tutorial video of it. You can go to my channel and watch that video or you will also find the link of it in the description of this video. But if you have difficulty unlocking it with iTunes, I will show you in this video that how to unlock your iPhone, iPad, iPod with 4U key passcode unlocker. This is the best alternative of iTunes to unlock disabled iPhone, iPad or iPod. You will find the link of it in the description of this video also. So this works on all iOS devices including the latest iPhones, iPads and iPods. It will help us to remove the forgotten passcode and unlock the disabled iOS devices in a single click. It's available in Windows and Mac both. All you need is to install the standard share for you key in your computer. It is very easy to install. After you install it in your computer, just tap on unlock lock screen passcode button here. So now, tap on the start button. So the next step is to put our iPhone into the recovery mode. It is just a volume and home button trick. You just need to select your iPhone model and follow the instructions given on the screen to put the iPhone into the recovery mode. Let's start. First, connect your iOS device to the PC. Make sure you have original Apple Lightning cable to avoid any kind of error while fixing the iPhone. Now just follow the instructions on the screen to put the iPhone into the recovery mode. After you put your iOS device in the recovery mode, you will see this type of screen. Now just go ahead to the PC and you will see this screen. Now tap on the download button to download the latest iOS version freeware file to fix your iPhone. It may take time to download the file. Keep the iPhone and internet connected with the computer. After the download completes, this will start fixing your iOS device. This is the simple process to fix the disabled iPhone, iPad or iPod without iTunes. This process will take 7 to 10 minutes to complete. If you are having any error while fixing the iPhone, so visit the description of this video for some more details. After waiting few minutes, my iPhone is back to the hello screen. Now we just need to set up our iPhone to go to the home screen. Now while setting up your iPhone, you will see this apps and data screen. From these options, you can restore your previous data back to your iOS device. You can restore data from iCloud backup, iTunes backup or transfer data from any other iOS or Android devices. But I will not transfer any data and select the last option, do not transfer apps and data.
So, after setting up your iPhone, you will see the home screen. So, as you can see, my iPhone has unlocked. This is the simple, fast, easy method to unlock your iPhone without iTunes. I hope you like this video. If you have not subscribed to my channel yet, so do it now. And also check out my other videos. Have a good day and see you later in the next video. Peace.